All right, let's start recording in three, two, one. Hey, everybody, Boston here. Got to click in the window. There we go. Uh, back with another Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Daily. Looks like we have Kane. Uh, uh, so, uh, fair warning here. I am running on about two hours sleep, and it's really warm in here. Ooh, a little haunt. Um, so, man, I was thinking this run's going to be real interesting because uh, I am pretty out of it, so... You know, this is adding a, an additional la a layer of difficulty on top of Isaac. Uh, that is sort of self-inflicted here. Alright, so... We are going to... Normal, mo normal mode darkroom? It looks like. So that's... Not as bad, I guess, since it's on normal mode. Damage is looking pretty good. Yeah, he starts out with two, so that's not bad. All right. Um, no, I don't. I don't think I really like that. Um, that trinket very much. I I kind of get it. Um, maybe I haven't thought about how it synergizes well enough yet, but ooh, nice. Tears and shot speed. Look at that. Mm-mm. All right, let's get comfy here. Bring this mic closer to me. Lean back a little bit. Oh, I gotta take off my Fitbit here. Ha! Huh. Pinching. Might as well charge it up. Gotta plug it in here. Nope. I'll do that later. There we go. Okay. Little Haunt doing a little bit of good work here. I guess something like Little Haunt would be pretty good here at the at the beginning. Um, just give you that extra little bit of damage right at the get go. Whoop. Stay away from the red fire. How's that sound? Whoop. Curse of the maze. All right. Didn't even notice. Well, Little Han is MVP right now. Uh, I'd rather take High Priestess. Well, we can't afford anything. So... <laughs> Alright. Back to where we started. At least we have the shop open. Uh, well, I have a lot of keys right now, actually. Well, at least I have it open, so if... I found find a whole bunch of items. We do have the... Uh, the restock item, which is really good, uh, and can really break the game wide open if you can get the right combo of stuff. So we'll see if I can do anything interesting here. Thankfully, just remembered it's burning basement, so cannot step on any of that fire. Sure, little gish. Why not? Okay. Really loves this room. Would be really curious to see what the algorithm is behind that. I sort of assume that it's random, but... Alright. Oh, that's harmless. Enough. Oh, I could have stomped the other two, buddy. Oh well. Alright, let's get something good here. Maybe the PJs? PJs would be great. Ew. <laughs> let's see what we have in here first. Uh, let's do Guppy's head just to get not only a spacebar item, but... Um, well, I got another heart out of that. I don't have any more... Nothing on the floor. So... I eh, just kind of balanced all my stats. That's not so bad. The extra heart container was great. So I've got one piece of guppy here, so one third of the way to the the grand guppy dream. Definitely hitting that thing. Oh, okay. Really start want to start looking for more damage here. My shot speed is still really great, so I'm I'm pretty happy with that. Range is okay. Almost just walked into that shot like a big dummy. Um, 
But damage is the only thing that I find kind of... Uh, ah, a little bit lacking. Which, you know, it's just the third floor, so it's not... That's not surprising. Not like yesterday's uh, hour and 15 minute long run. Where I had zero damage the entire time. That was rough. Not gonna lie. I was talking to somebody today about that run, and uh, I have I have vowed to not quit an Isaac run, because um, almost every Isaac run is going to be winnable. Um, I mean, if you want to be super reductive about it, you can win every run by not taking any damage, um, which is <laughs> clearly never going to happen for me. Um, oh, it might be a secret room back here. Um, but man, that was a run that, that's a run I just wanted to tap out of. Got it done, so, you know, I, I can't be that mad about it, but, I guess it was kind of fun. It's, it's fun when you get an Isaac, I guess Isaac is kind of fun in a weird way where you get, uh, sure, GB bug. Um... Where you can get a run that is just, you know, 100% broken, um, and you're just flying through the game. Uh, but you do occasionally get those runs where it seems like the game is really working against you. Um, and I kind of find those runs a little bit fun because you don't... You have to struggle the whole time. It's not really... You know, they don't... The game doesn't hand you the win. I struggled that whole run. There we go. Let's pick that up. Let's go bomb into our uh, curse room here. Hey. Oh. The work related text. Oh, let me check that real quick. I think something good actually just happened. Two moments. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Almost just thought, oh, I'll walk out that other door. Nope. Alright, sorry about that. I'm not a, uh... This YouTube thing isn't my full-time job, so... Gotta keep my wits about me. Alright, let's go back up here. We've uh, thankfully discovered everything down there. Oh. Come on. Yeah, little haunt. Good work, buddy. Those green ones are the ones that split? Yeah. That stinks. Okay. That worked out pretty nicely. Uh, no marked rocks there. Pestilence. Oh, in a small room. Oh, it's the one that shoots creep. This sort of stinks. Oh, my range. <laughs> go, little haunt, go. Ah. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Alright, so now we have a uh, an orbital. That's it for that floor. We're ahead of boss rush at this point. Alright, it's a uh, sacrifice room. Yeah, I like those guys. Pretty cute. I like the occasional cute enemy in uh, Binding of Isaac. Or a little Gertie, who's just the cutest in the entire game. Alright. The aforementioned damage uh, deficiencies really hitting me here now. Also, these guys have so much health, it's a little ridiculous. But, I have uh, spoken at length on that topic before, so I won't... Uh, Beat a dead horse. 
Hasn't been... Oh, that was dumb. Hasn't been patched at this point, so I, I wonder if, uh... Uh, Ed and the team over Nicholas sort of designed those characters to have that much health. You run into them pretty early, so it, it seems like it's a little bit unbalanced. Wow, really? Um, but, you know. They designed this game very specifically, so... Woohoo. You never know what their true intentions were. Okay. Just stay away. Oh. Yeah, I was talking a little bit yesterday about those, uh... Those red flies that, uh, explode. Uh, and they, you can tell because they have their cheeks puffed out. Same thing with those, uh, black spiders that explode. That's a nice little sort of subconscious uh, design work that I really like. Subconscious probably isn't the right word, but you get what I'm going for. Go ahead, little haunt. I'll clean up the riffraff. Ooh. So I'm doing pretty okay on health at this point, which is pretty great. Oh, here we go. I don't know why I got stuck on that rock all of a sudden. Okay, so we have plenty enough money to go into the shop on this floor. We haven't found the item room yet? No. So I still have that to do. Whoop, whoop. Got a runner. There we go. I mean, the more mushrooms you blow up for me, buddy, the, the more that helps me. Alright, we got our item room. Holy Mantle's pretty great. <laughs> Saving me immediately. <laughs> Thank you, Holy Mantle. Oh, I forgot to turn off our automatic cat box before I start recording. Oh, that's gonna be loud in a minute. Alright, so we have our boss. Let's try and find this shop here real quick. I think I'll get a deal with the devil. So I'm not too worried about... No, I don't have any bombs. Okay. Dark bomb would be nice for that room. I'm not too, too worried about taking additional damage here. Uh, one more. There we go. Alright, back off, buddy. Another one? Oh, just a little little poop. Ah, I got another marked rock. Ah, no bombs. That stinks. Alright, well, if we find a bomb, there's a marked rock up there. I'll never remember that. So, in one ear and out the other. Uh, that's probably a dead end to the right. That's a dead end to the left. Okay, then. Uh, so let's go this way. Oh, I already went in the shop. That was the greed fight. Pfft. Whew. Okay. See the beginning of the video with, you know, two hours sleep. Apparently sleeping me thought it was a really good idea to rip my CPAP mask off in the middle of the night. Thank you, Holy Mantle. Um, after I'd gotten about two hours sleep, so... The rest of the night I didn't really sleep. I don't know why I would do that. It's not very bright. I almost lined up with GB Bug there for a minute. That would have been pretty nice. Yeeps. Oh. Ah, uh, speed up, sure. My shadow? Is that what that is? It is. Hmm. So my shadow, if I remember what it does, is uh, when you get hit, it spawns a familiar, like a leech familiar, that'll fight for you. 
but I think it has a its own health pool, so it's not you know it's not indestructible like uh, the traditional leech, you know like your normal leeches. Um, so this might actually be a good pickup with um, Holy Mantle because I can afford to get hit every once in a while to try and spawn somebody without it really affecting my health or my score. Not something I'm going to go out of the way to test at the moment, uh, but I might do it here with a shot from one of these guys. No, it didn't do it. Okay, so maybe I actually have to take damage. If so, then that's less useful, but, you know, the, the goal of the dailies here is don't take damage. Um, but, you know, we'll see how well I do on that today. Come on. Just one little... Thank you. Okay, so bombless run this time. Oh. Oh, right. <laughs> it's Kane, so it only shoots out of one side. Forgot. That always manages... Wow. Really? You're just, you're just gonna let that sit there? Behind one key? All right, it's all you, little haunt. Yep, let's get it. Well, I'll get that too, I guess. <laughs> you know, I, even if I had to spend three bomb, three keys to get a uh, Doctor Fetus, that's fine. All right, so my range is hurting me a little bit here. That's Kamikaze, and that's not worth it. Even though I guess it might synergize with. Uh, Holy Mantle, maybe, but I don't like it enough to try, to put it quite honestly. Oof, um, I'm going to pick up PhD and one bomb. Well, I guess I can pick up this pill now, pheromones. Range up, great. Range up. Range up. It's like a... Arcade machine announcer. I don't even need to- why did I pick up a bomb? I have Dr. Fetus. Oh well. Hadn't fully processed. Yo, you have Dr. Fetus now. So, your days of worrying about bombs are over. There we go. Uh, I don't have any uh, coins. Now I do. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep moving. I'm at making good enough time here that I could do boss boss rush. Do the usual bomb fling in here. That's one of the strangest things I've seen with Dr. Fetus just hanging out. HP and luck up, which is good. Come on, guppy item. Oh, I didn't Uh, I didn't pick up those pills. Especially with PhD. Those could have been real good. Alright. Lemon party is pretty good. I'm always a fan of this pill. I'm trying to figure out how to word it so that I don't say anything inappropriate, but the amount of damage that pill does and the the length that it stays, uh, the length of time that it stays on the ground is, uh, pretty great. Oh, there's a mark rock. Oh, man! Small rock. The damage is still at three. I don't think damage really affects... Oh. Oh, God. I couldn't... I couldn't get away. Um. I think the damage that... Dr. Fetus does isn't really affected by your damage stat. If I remember. So. Small Rock, unfortunately, isn't that great of a pickup. I mean, I'm always going to take it, because it's Small Rock, but. Nothing that's really going to make or break this run at this point. Okay. Finding plenty of bombs now. Ah, 
Thank you. <laughs> Good job, little haunt. Continuing to do some fine work. Did I even find the item room? No. Flying through it. Here we go. Are you a wizard? Are you a wizard? Luck up, which is great. Tears up, which is great. And I'll keep Lemon Party. Okay. Let's find the item room here. What floor are we on? Dank Depths 2. Okay. So should have enough time to get uh, Boss Rush. Actually, was there a Telepills back in that room? I don't remember. If there is, I'd rather take that into Boss Rush so I can get an item and get out. Oh, I don't like cracked ice. Nah, I definitely don't need that. Paralysis. Paralysis. Okay, I have enough money here that definitely going into the shop is a good idea. Oh man. Lined up perfectly. Oh, Diplopia would be really good. Can I get three more cents? Diplopia would mean that I could take every item in the uh, boss rush. I would like that quite a bit, potentially. Okay, no money in there. Um, so, ah, come on, man. Yeah, that's not gonna... Alright, no option to do that. Oh, I'm running out of time here. Okay, well, I can use Lemon Party on Mom, at least. Start tossing these guys. Woo! Taste that! Ah. Uh, there we go. Ah! That's fine. Deal with the devil, quick! No! <laughs> Well, that's not really what I was looking for. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, yeah, I'm going to take Head of Krampus. Mostly because it gives me the range that I don't really have right now. Um, and I have enough damage that taking uh, uh, Guppy's head really isn't going to get me a lot. Oh, that didn't kill him? Jeez. Oh no. <laughs> this is a little too early to do this. This is in the chest. Hey, secret room. GB bug helping out a little bit there. Alright. GB bug helping out a lot there. Okay. Ah, look at all this money now. <laughs> e all right. Really want to save uh, Krampus's head for whatever boss is on this floor. Hopefully, something like Mama Gertie that doesn't really move around all that much. Um, I don't really need the bombs. Just figuring out, like, oh, should I spend the bombs to get in there? Nope. I should not. Hoping this is the right way. Alright, no. I'll get some keys. Get my swag bonus up a little bit. I'm trying to think of items that uh, would be pretty beneficial at this point. Oh, this room sucks. Um, glitter bombs would be pretty nice. Uh, at the very least for the shrag points. Well, that was rude. 
Um, so you can probably... Dr. Fetus and Glitter Bombs, you could probably farm a lot of swag points over a, a period of time. Not a, not a lot of time that I would spend on a video, or probably playing normally. Uh, I feel like I would get bored faster than anything else. Um, but, you know, there's a good potential there for uh, taking a time hit uh, and just... Oh, Conquest. Sure, just spin a little bit. Um, playing outside. Um, but you can probably farm a, a, a pretty good amount of points for that. Oh, I don't know how Maw of the Void does. I can take this, and then I'll take that. I don't know what Empty Vessel does, but I guess we'll find out. <laughs> um... Oh, are we flying now because of something? Great. Must be Empty Vessel. I was gonna take uh, the pony, but... If I don't need to because I'm flying from something else, then we're good. And we have Fate. That's a good backup. Alright, let's take all that. Pick that up just in case. Uh, no Marked Rocks. Alright. So, at this point, probably gonna be a run that I can finish. Sure. Um, I'm gonna kinda hope here. Uh, with all the items that are available... Um, oh, I can't pass through those guys, I forgot about that. Um, probably not gonna be very high on the leaderboards. Um, as, uh, many other... Uh, more seasoned players are probably gonna get to Dr. Fetus a little bit faster, but that's fine. I don't always have to be the best. I just have to be happy with my run. And so far, I'm pretty happy with this run. There's a marked rock. Can't even pick those up. First world problems. Okay. I was thinking about bombing out of that room, but I was worried that I would turn into it would turn into a situation like this. Oh, nice freeze. Come on. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting the hell out of there. There's nothing for me there. Uh secret room, maybe? There we go. Sure, it's almost always a trap. No. Okay. Surprised it didn't spawn five ragmen or something like that. I don't need to stay in here. So close. Oh. Those are the enemies that make it really hard with Dr. Fetus. Oh, that's a nice room for this. And to think, I was complaining about damage earlier. Yeah, sure. Not worth it. <laughs> oh, okay. Always have problems when I have too many pieces of fistula up. I don't think my brain can always keep track of them. Fought that boss I don't know how many hundreds of times. Actually, I guess Maw the Void wasn't... Okay, for the, I was just holding down the fire button. Maw the Void probably wasn't the best pickup, but I thought that um, Empty Vessel required that you didn't have any full Red Heart containers. Because if I just hold down the fire button, this is what happens. And that's a bad time. It'd be a good time if I had Pyromaniac. Um, but I don't, so it's just potentially a murdering situation. Oh, man. Sure, Kidney Stone? <laughs> I, I, I feel like I've just started to wrap my head around this item, even though I don't, I don't have it unlocked in my save. Got a text on my phone, look down. Got hit. So I'm curious to see if it works with this. Man, game. Alright, we're not doing this. Could just bombed out of there, but 
You never know what you're going to find. Ooh. Should have been hit there. Glad I wasn't. Alright, here we go. Boss time. There we go. Now my wife's heading home. Oh, stop turning, man. You're really killing me here. Oh, man. I don't think Lemon Party hurts. It lives. Nope. Well, I got that Polaroid invincibility, which is great. Uh, I'm not gonna fight Hush. I could probably use the points, but... I don't necessarily know if I have the, the time right right now. Kinda got a late start here. Okay, pick up one of those, just in case. Double Greed and a Fistula. Boy, only in Shoal, huh? Hashtag only in Shoal. My favorite Weezer song. Okay. Suddenly taking a... Ah, there's my shadow. <laughs> oh, it's one of the charging uh, maggots. Okay. What makes you larger is not something I'm really looking for. Open both of these guys. Fates Reward is fine. It doesn't shoot out... It shoots out my original damage tiers, not uh, not Dr. Fetus, which I guess makes sense. That would probably make it a little bit too powerful slash uh, mind-bending. Um, mostly too powerful. So, that's fine. I, <laughs> I don't want to make it sound like I'm, I'm giving the game permission. Like, okay, I, I guess that's okay. Just trying to rationalize it in my own my own brain. Sure. Blow both of these guys. Hematemesis, which isn't gonna get me anything. Oh, I got a red heart from something. Where did I get that from? Fate's reward, maybe? Or whatever whatever that item was that I picked up. Oh well. Yeah, I guess because now I, uh... I'm still flying, but it looks like it's because I have fate. Use it for both of those guys, because they're annoying. Yoo-hoo! Okay, I forgot he had that attack. There we go. Alright, this is the part that's kind of a pain because uh, his feet can sort of kick aside these bombs. Good job, little haunt. Playing bouncer here. They're on screen long enough that I can do some damage to them, but... There we go. Ah. Well, that killed him. Take this pill just because, and we're done. 30 minutes. 1170. Yeah, that seems about right. <laughs> right below a winky face. Alright. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I thought that was a pretty good run, and, you know, certainly a lot faster than uh, yesterday's run. Uh, if you enjoyed, please toss me a like and a subscribe on YouTube. They both help out a ton, and I will see you next time.